So I wanted to talk about off market to being on market, especially sellers going, well, I don't want to hit the market. If you've got a buyer at this price, let's talk. The difference between that is that I sold a familiar property that was in a high rise and the apartments were very similar. We had one buyer who was looking off market who was local. And then we had another one that went on the market which was bought by interstate. Now that interstate buyer would have had no idea about that off-market property unless it was advertised. We end up getting a better price for the one that was on the market than the off-market at the end of the day. And that just goes to show the off-market doesn't have competition where the on-market does. So a lot of people are going, well, I'm not sure if I want to go to market or not. I go, well, the only way you're going to find out the true value of your property is if you go on the market because an off-market is only one buyer. There may be another person out there who's willing to pay more and that's the difference. So competition is always going to push the price up. Some off-market sales, don't get me wrong, you can get some incredible prices for that. But how do you know there's not another person out there who's just not aware that's willing to pay more than that price just because they're not aware of the property? So why not explore that option and give your property the best chance of getting the highest possible price on this market?